All right, law students, buckle up, because today I'm breaking down how to ace your civil procedure course in just a few minutes. Whether you're struggling to keep up or just need a quick refresher, I've got you covered. First up, let's talk about the federal rules of civil procedure. These are the guidelines that govern the process of civil litigation in federal courts. Think of them as the playbook for your favorite sport. They tell you what you can and can't do and when you need to do it. Now, one of the most important rules is Rule 8, which deals with pleadings. Basically, pleadings are the formal documents you submit to the court to start your case. The key here is to be clear and concise. Your complaint needs to state the grounds for the court's jurisdiction, a statement of the claim, and the demand for relief. Simple, right? Next, let's dive into Rule 12, which covers defences and objections. This rule can be your best friend if you're on the defence side. It outlines the various motions you can file to dismiss a case, like for lack of jurisdiction or failure to state a claim. Knowing Rule 12 inside and out can help you shut down a case before it even gets started. Now, moving on to Discovery, which is governed by Rules 26 through 37. Discovery is like the fact-finding mission of your case. You get to ask the other side for documents, depositions and anything else that can help you build your case. But remember, Discovery can be a double-edged sword. You have to give as much as you get. Let's not forget about summary judgment under Rule 56. This rule allows you to ask the court to decide the case in your favour before it even goes to trial. If you can show there's no genuine dispute of material fact and you're entitled to judgment as a matter of law, you could win the case right then and there. Finally, keep in mind the importance of timelines. Missing a deadline can be catastrophic, so always keep track of due dates for filings and responses. And there you have it, a quick and dirty guide to acing your civil procedure course. Remember, understanding these rules not only helps you get good grades, but it's also essential for your future career as a lawyer. Keep studying, stay motivated, and you'll crush it. Thanks for watching.